Welcome to Talking with the Wannabe Stars. We have a very special program for you tonight. Our guests are two very well-known people. Tell us about yourself. My name is Courtney. And where are you from, Courtney? Jersey. Do yes. I seem like I'm from Jersey? Sort of. Okay, mm -hmm. so um, what brings you to our show tonight? Well, I was kind of dropped off by the police on my way to prison. Yep. So, uh, tell our viewers about yourself. I go to prison a lot. <laughs> yes, um, what would people know you from? Prison. <laughs> so, where do you live? Let me guess in prison. Jersey. Oh. <laughs> the Jersey prison? I don't go to prison. Are you okay. a stalker or something? Okay, what special talents or skills do you have besides um, going to prison? Robbing banks. I knew that. I knew that was going to come. Okay. And singing and dancing. I am like the star. The star. Calm I'm down. <laughs> Calm down. Okay. I want to be on Jersey What's your Shore? favorite thing to do? Practice for being on Jersey Shore because I am a wannabe. See this face? Star material. What's <laughs> your favorite sport and why? I don't do sports. But if singing and dancing and being a star counts as a sport, then I do all three. Oh, wow. Very athletic. Or was that four? Very I didn't go to school, so I wouldn't know. What's your favorite movie and why? Jersey Shore. And now, okay. if Jersey Shore went to prison, that would be like the show. Okay. That would be like so me. So, Taylor, what brings you to our show tonight? Well, I just, I was writing my new song, and like, the phone started ringing, and I picked it up, and it said that I was invited here, so I got so excited. I was jumping up and down, and it got so excited, and I came here. Okay, so where do you live, um, Taylor? I live in Tennessee. Okay. And I see you brought your guitar. Would you like to play it? Of course I would. <laughs> Just one second. Okay. Let me guess the butterfly song. Uh, how'd you know? <laughs> guess. There's these lots of butterflies swirling in my house. Butterflies, butterflies. They love to fly in 
a butterfly And that's what they'll say Butterfly, I love to fly away Butterfly, butterfly, butterfly <laughs> And that was Taylor Robinson Hi. playing on her guitar <laughs> horribly Okay what special talents or skills do you have besides breaking guitar? Um, well, I'd love to go play guitar <laughs> instead of breaking it, of course. Yep. So what's your favorite thing to do besides playing a guitar? Singing! <laughs> I'm, okay. I'm the best singer in this world, and I'm better than you. That is offensive. <laughs> yep. I am the best singer. <laughs> so, um... Do you have any movies that you really like? Well, I really like guitar movies and Miley Cyrus because she's just she's just so in right now. So um, she was out like, when her show when her show Hannah Montana stopped. Were you so sad? Um, I, I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> yeah, because she had a mental breakdown. Hmm. Okay, so um, hope you enjoyed our talk with um, Courtney and Taylor Robinson, everybody. <laughs> Thank you, children of the sun. And until next oh, time, my children. Until next time, this is Alex Ryan signing off. Thank from you. Oh, <laughs> talking you. with the wannabe stars. And good night, everybody. I am a star. Good night. <laughs> I am a star. Good oh, night, everybody. Cool. Have a great but time. Bad. Until next time. Why, my children. Hello, and welcome to our show. Wanna be stars? We have a very special program for you today. Our guests are two very well-known people and we're pleased to have them with us. So what's your name? Tater Tots. I love Tater Tots. And how about you? I'm Ash Ketchum and I'm gonna be the Pokemon Master. Okay. Go Pikachu! Okay, Tater Tots. I have to my coffee. What brings you guys to My name is in Tater Tots. It's Fred. What Gosh. Mm. Okay, what brings you guys here today? Well, I smelled Tater Tots, so I just like ran in the door and I was just like, mmm, Tater Tots. Wait, and then there were no Tater Tots. Wait, this isn't the Pokemon League? But, 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 but I have all eight gym badges. What? No! My, po my joy of being a Pokemon master is being ruined. This is all your fault. You did nothing. You, you stole my Pikachu. I was running away from Kevin. And you, you, you. Really? Yeah. It was Misty. Misty's always the one. I'll get it for this. Can I have some coffee? Uh, I'm sure he doesn't need coffee. Neither do I. Okay, where do you guys live? I live in the Kanto region, where, where, where I, I caught my first Pokemon. Where do you live? Well, I live anywhere near Judy. Uh, okay, how old are you guys? I'm, I, I'm 10, um, I, I just became a trainer, and I'm gonna be Pokemon Master, yeah! Woo! And you? Judy. Judy's not an age, but oh, 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 sorry. Um, I'm like five and a half. I'm turning six next year. Okay. Um, so tell us about Pokemon. Well, they stay very complicated. So they stink real bad. So they never when take showers. To, when you're trying to catch a Pokemon, what Neither you need do to I. do? You need to you you need to battle with, with another Pokemon so their HP gets below ten percent. And then you need to throw what's called a Pokeball, which is a capsule system called, uh, shaped like a ball. And there's a button in the middle of it. When you throw it, the Pokemon oh. gets captured. But sometimes it takes but sometimes it takes multiple tries. Okay. And then you use your Pokemon that you caught to get the gym badges. And then you become the Pokemon Master, and it's really fun. <gasps> okay, Fred. Oh what what? Oh my gosh. 
sorry, I was dreaming about you. Do you have any hobbies and skills? Oh, my skills being really <coughs> annoying, and um, I love running away from um, Kevin because he's really mean. So you love running away from him? No, I just hate him. <sighs> okay, I think that's it for now. So we're gonna wrap it up here. <laughs> Wait, do I get tater tots after the show? Maybe. <gasps> okay. Draw to catch them all. We're gonna say goodbye to Fred, Pokemon Boy here. And that's the end of Wannabe Stars. Becca Fort signing off. Bye. Welcome to our show. Well, we have a very special pr program for you today. Our guests are two very well-known people, and, and we are pleased to have them with us. I'll let them introduce your themselves. What brings you to our show today? Well, you know, I'm like, uh, I'm Lionel Messi, and I'm like famous in like Spain and like Argentina, but I need to spread my fame into like the United States. So that's why I came here to get on TV. Tell our viewers about yourself. Well, you know, as uh, I'm like one of the best soccer players in the world. Uh, uh. I mean, everyone knows that. Where do you live? Um, I live in Barcelona. Okay. H how old are you? 24. Do you, uh, do you have any jobs or hobbies? Um. Well, I play soccer as a job and as a hobby. Uh. Do uh. Do you have any? Special skills or talents? Soccer. I'm like the best player in the world. Besides like Pele, but he's like retired. Yeah. He's so dead. Is, so, no. so, 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 yeah. what, so what's, so what's your favorite thing to, to do? Play soccer, I mean, dull. You Ooh. know, offense is the best. No one likes defense and goalie. I mean, defense and goalie is just like so You're boring. a midfielder. No, I'm a forward. Prove it. Look on my stats. No. Yeah. Prove it. Fine. I'll prove it later. Okay. When? After guys, guys. I'll be sleeping there. Good for you. Okay. What is your fav favorite sport and why? Soccer. I mean, duh. I'm like the best player in the world. Who doesn't know that? Okay. I think you've said that like 10 times already. So yeah, can I you know. just 17. Like, 17. Like, are you, are, are, are you sure? Dude, dude, dude. Everyone has to know. Come on. I'm like the best soccer player in the world. And I'm the best sleeper in the world. Like, yeah. Honestly. Okay. What is your f f favorite movie? Why? And what do you like about it? The messy movie? Um, no. Um, let's see. Mission Impossible, the ghostly protocol. I mean, it's funny and it's like awesome. Okay, it, 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 at least you said something other than, I like soccer, I'm like the most, the, the, the worst soccer player in no, the world. No, I'm actually the best in case you Second. misunderstood me. I'm yeah. the best. Pele is retired, so he doesn't count Just anymore. shut up and He's get the to the, the point. Brazil team. You're the, the best. Is there anything else you would like to t tell our audience tonight? Well, I'm the best soccer player in the we world. We know that. Know. Shut I up. hope you do. I mean, like everyone in the United States has to know that by now. I mean, I'm on TV. Okay. Now to Wait, the... Wait, what? 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 I'm on TV. Can't you not see all those cameras? What? I don't... Oh, uh, what do you I mean? don't see none. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't see any cameras. We're just talking, right? Okay, well, let's go to that sleeper, dude. Sleeper. It's called a sleeping. A sl uh, what is your name? I don't remember. <laughs> I forgot my watch, so I can't. I just don't remember. Wow, what brings you to our show today? He wants to sleep in front of everyone. An inn? A hotel. Come on. Okay. Do they have actual beds? Um, I sir. know, like these chairs are so annoying. I just came back from a soccer game and I was playing Real Madrid. I mean, Shut up! I was playing Cristiano Ronaldo. He's good. He's like the second best, but like, you know, I'm the best. I scored two hat tricks. Mm. You made 
our guest. Any blankets? <laughs> you will get to go to sleep after the show. Okay? I know, but then he won't be able to prove that he's the worst soccer player. No, Tell I'm not the best. Tell us about yourself. What would people know you from? I think they've already realized that. Where do you live? What, on the bed? On the streets. How old are Who you? Who wouldn't know that? How old are you? I told you, I forgot my watch. I don't know. How would your watch have your age? I don't know. Do you have any jobs or hobbies? I forgot my calculator, too. I'm guessing a hobby of yours is sleeping? Really you now? I uh, know. I do wonder. Yeah. Do you have any special skills or talents? Play soccer. Sleeping. Not you! I mean, I have to tell everyone. I'm well, the best I soccer player. I slept everywhere in Real Madrid, uh, I don't know, on somebody's head. Uh, <laughs> I slept over the Empire State Building. I Ooh. fell sleeping from a plane. Okay, okay. Parachute sleeping. That's what uh. What? Sleeping. What sleeping is sleeping on a waterbed? Oh, okay. Yeah. What is oh, yeah, your the rapids? Yeah, those. Yeah, my favorite thing is to play uh, soccer against like Real Madrid because then I can like poke Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay. And like I'll just like injure him and poke. like the uh, referee won't give me like sleep. a yellow card. And then he can be in the stands and like uh, see me like. On um, I'm sorry. Well, we are out of time today, so I get to sleep. Yes. Do I get to go play soccer? No. Yes. Now, bye. Now, I am that British dude without a British accent, and I am signing off. Welcome to the Big Green Guest Machine. Hello, and welcome to our show, The Green Screen Guessing Machine. Today our contestant will be transported to other locations by standing in front of our screen screen. Images are projected on the green screen behind them through the magic of chroma key. They will then have to guess where they are by using the clues given to them by our clue givers. Our first contestant is Connor. Yo, what's going on? Let's get started. The first clue is that it has an emergency exit. Is it an airplane? No. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. The second clue is that it has many windows. Is it a bus? That is correct. correct. Hello, and welcome to our show, The Green Screen Guessing Machine. Today, our contestant will be transported to other location by standing in front of our green screen. And by the way, I'm, I was just, I'm the new host, he got fired. And so here we go. Clues? <laughs> I'll lead it off to the clue givers. Um, it is full of, it is a very tall building. Very tall building. Um. Another clue. It is in Great Britain, meaning London. The Eiffel Tower. Well, the, yeah, no. Um, no. I need another clue. <laughs> there are four houses. Houses. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Three no. tall towers. Three tall. <laughs> I don't know a lot about London. That is not it. <laughs> okay, another clue. Do you want to go to the last resort clue? No. Um, okay, sure. All right, let's say it together. It's it is full, full of magic. magic. Oh, Disney World. Oh no! That's your seventh clue given. The answer was. Or should we give her another clue? 
I can't get this. Think I more clues are needed. Like... Okay. Um, think more clues are needed, boys. Uh. Okay. It it is a very famous fictional story. Pinocchio. <laughs> no, that is not the answer. <laughs> We've given her eight clues now. That's over <laughs> the amount. Eight clues. Darn it. So the correct answer Shh. is. That wasn't that. I don't know what that is. It wasn't eight clues. Okay, um, uh, there are seven movies. Harry Potter. No. Specify. A little more specific. I, I, I don't really know Harry Potter, but. Okay. It's not the answer. Where it takes place. It takes place. It takes. I'm guessing it's Harry. It seems where like it takes place. Trouble. That's what we want. Where it takes place. What? what? Where does it take the place? Where the stories of Harry Potter takes place. It's not that hard. Hogwarts. There we yes. go. Okay. That is correct. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So that's all the time we have for today, folks. We'll see you next time. Hello and w and welcome to our show, the Green Screen Guess Machine. Uh, uh, today, our con contestants will will will, will we try to transport to other locations by standing in front of our green screen. The, the images are projected on the green screen uh, so, uh, behind them through, through the magic of the chroma key. So uh, they, uh, they, uh, th 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 they will then have to guess wh uh, wh uh, wh uh, where the, uh, they are by using the clues by g g given to them by our clue givers. Our first contestant is Mackenzie. Let's get started. What's the first clue? Okay, there's thousands of people in something. A city. No. You are wrong. Question two. There is food at this place. Very good hot dogs. Um, Very yummy. A baseball game. Close, but too bad in your face. Question three. They move lawn daily at this place. Um, Fenway Park. Very good hot dogs, D and uh, you uh, are correct. Ding, ding, you ding. stink. Congratulations, Mackenzie. She has done it. She has done it, folks. She has done it. Woo! Folks, she has done it. Hello and welcome to our show, the Green Screen Guessing Machine. Today our contestants will be transported to other locations by standing in front or sitting of our green screen. Images are projected on the screen behind them through the magic of Chroma Key. They will then have to guess where they are by using the clues given to them by our lovely clue givers. Our first contestant is um, Nisha. Let's get started. Okay, first clue is that is someone is always performing. A rock concert. How'd you get that? How'd you get that? It's not a Correct! Wow, and it looks like uh, Nisha just like made everyone else look bad. Like, <laughs> wow. <laughs> Woo! Woo -hoo! And Nisha gets five million dollars. Five million dollars! Hello and welcome to our show. I'm Becca Ford here on the green screen guessing machine. 
Today our contestant will be transferred to other locations by standing in front of our green screen. Our first contestant today is Amo, and our clue givers are Santiago and Connor. Let's get started. Your first clue is there's water. Is it the ocean? No. And no. Your second clue. Your second clue is that part of it, well, most of it, is green. Third clue? Your third clue is that it is mucky. Repeat the third clue, please. Your third clue is that it is mucky. Next clue, please. The next clue is that a lot of plants grow there. Is it a coral reef? No. Your next clue, animals live there. God, that's not even a clue. Okay. Your next clue is that it is usually near a, a river. Or the ocean. Wait. Please don't say the clue. Next clue. Your next clue. By the way, this is clue number eight. Clue number eight is that. Is that. At this place, there are many frogs. Ninth clue. Wait. Wait. Can you repeat the fifth clue again? Fifth. There are many frogs. That was, that the, was eighth. the eighth clue. He doesn't remember the fifth clue. Can you repeat all the clues from the beginning? <laughs> no, we can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't remember all the clues. Okay. Repeat them, please. Well, um... There are many of them in Acton. I asked you to repeat the first eight clues. I think that's all. The first couple clues are that there's water, it's mostly green, there's frogs, and then your next clue, there's plants, there's animals, and your next clue, listen close. It's there are rocks. At this well, place. Lots and lots yes, there of is. rocks. There's rocks at this place. Well, there's more logs than rocks. Okay, this is the 10th clue, and we're going to give the answer. The 10th clue is that um, usually beavers do a lot of work there. Okay, 10th clue. Wait, wait, wait. Um. Is it a stream? Close. Close? But what's around but no, the stream? Not a lot. No. That was not even that was close. Okay. Would you like us to give you the answer? No. Would you like us to give more clues or would you like thinking time? Thinking time, please. Okay. You have five seconds. You do I'm not sorry have that five. you have thirty seconds. Four. Is it a canal? No. You are absolutely incorrect. Wait, I have another yes, I It is not man made. <laughs> it looks like Connor is very bad about that clue. Let's see if we can have more thinking time. You have 19 seconds. Okay, we do not have any more time now. Wait, is it, um,. A uh, uh, stream created by erosion. Take it's marsh. <laughs> he is correctly wrong. Okay, that's the it end of our show today. It is a wetland, not a marshland. <sighs> okay, that's it's our show for today. Well, We're wrapping up here on the green screen guessing machine. Back and forth, signing off. Hi, 
guys, my name is Nisha. My favorite part of video camp was being the director. Hello, people viewing this. I'm Connor, and my favorite part of uh, video camp was being in the game show. Yippee. Okay, that's all. Hi. Uh, 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 I'm Akil, and my, and my favorite part about, about video camp uh, was, uh, was, uh, was being the director. I'm going to play a little tune for you. I'm Becca, and my favorite thing about the video camp was the talk show. Hey guys, it's Alex, and my favorite part of, uh, Video camp was um, being the host on the talk show. And by the way, I'm a ghost. Peace out. Howdy, I'm Jason Lucas. And my favorite thing about the video camp was being on the talk show. Hi, my name is Mackenzie. And my favorite part about this video camp was playing Courtney on the talk show. Hi, my name is Anmol. And my favorite thing about video camp was the game show. Hello, my name is Santiago. The fa my favorite part of the video cam was being director. Hello, hello, control room, hello, hello. technical difficulties awesome. light, light of your world we're having technical difficulties so um until next time this is uh alex ryan signing off